Well, I mean, you know, time is the most precious gift in the world. And I think through this pandemic, you know, God has granted us extra time. Monica Abbott does a lot with her time. She's used it to represent the University of Tennessee as one of the most decorated pitchers in NCAA history. And now, with the return of softball to the Olympics, she's using her time to represent the United States of America as part of Team USA. We really had a conversation about me returning to Team USA and being a part of that process and being part of the team and um, what I could do not only from the circle, but as um, just like a veteran now showing leadership and work ethic and dedication. It wasn't too hard of a bargain they were driving. And I said, I said yes, um, because it's one of, been one of my greatest joys to wear USA across my chest. But with the postponement of the Olympics to 2021, time seemed to stand still. Abbott and Team USA were playing scrimmages around the country as part of the Stand Beside Her tour when these decisions were made. It lifted a weight off her shoulders. It was a little bit of a sigh of relief because at least we knew information. You know, we knew something. We, ha we knew what was happening in the world and we could understand that instead of being stressed about, you know, how am I, how am I working out without my team? I'm, how am I not getting games in? People are sick. Am I going to get sick? Am I, am I going to get my family sick or get the fans sick? So since then, she's been training at home, but using her time wisely for herself and for the game. I hosted a workout class for softball players, an off-season workout class, and I've done a couple virtual events. And, you know, that sort of time is something that maybe I wouldn't have done if, if I was in season or if, if this pandemic hadn't come about. Instead of time lost, Abbott says there's time gained. Something was taken away from us. A season for a lot of the athletes has been taken away, but that doesn't mean that your love and passion for the game can't continue to grow. That doesn't mean your education for sports and for a healthy lifestyle can't continue to grow. Doing my best to use this time as a blessing.